Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys my loft haul that I purchased online. And I'll be unbagging a bunch of things for you here. I was able to get some cute tops, some other items that were petite sizes, which is what I'm always looking for. But um, yeah, I've got quite a bit of things here, so let's get right into it. All right, let's get started. Everything came um, in three separate bags, so let's try to get through this as soon as we can. A lot of the items I got were, are currently on sale, which is the reason why I had to make some purchases that I probably didn't need to. But this first one that I got, I believe is a dress. It's a petite, lacy, tiered, flutter dress. And this one I got on sale for $40. It's a cute little gauzy style dress. Um, it's got some cute flutter um, little details at the sleeve here. This one is a blue one. It's really cute. I got this in a size small petite. All right, let's get to the next item. And this one is a jumpsuit petite trellis garden ruffle jumpsuit in four petite and this one I got on sale for $50. Just get rid of that. And it's got it's a thin straps like this with a little bit of ruffle at the top and I believe it should be like wide leg also cropped but the print was really what made me very interested. I believe that every petite girl should have a pair of some sort of jumpsuit in their closet. So kind of wanted to show you guys something like this. All right. And the last bag I believe has the rest of my items. Ah, okay. All right. This one here is a top that I got. And I really like the print and the color. I always go for pink tops, but when I see like a nice, really pretty blue top, I have to start, you know, like adding more colors to my collection. So I thought I'd pick this one up. And this one's just a small, regular size. I thought this one was really cute. There was a lot of blues in this uh, season of summer clothing in the loft, so I thought that was really cool. And then I got another top here. This one is a white top, and it's a small petite. I was able to find this one in a small petite. And this one I thought was really cute too, because it's got a little peplum bottom to it with some uh, detail on it with a little bit of ruffle lining up top there if you see the little detail and then the back is really cute so charming there's a little bit of a tie back there where it's a little bit lower and this one is a small petite and this one also was on sale um, for $18 so everything was like 40% off and then on top of that I think there was another 20% off added and that sorry this blue top that I purchased floral banded hem flutter top was also $18 like that's a deal right there and then I got a peach tree mixed media top and this one's just a regular small size and I got this for 16 so I had to pick this up as well. This one is really cute. So it's like a peachy tone, definitely a peachy pinky tone, more peach than pink, um, but it is like a sweater, a thin cool sweater type material. And then the sleeves are really pretty, like it's got like this uh, chiffon type sleeve, so it's definitely, you know, different fabric from the actual top which I think is really neat. Let's just see how this looks. 
Then I had to pick up a small petite Japanese garden navy dress with floral print and this one was on sale for $30. Definitely had to add some floral dressy pieces of course just because it's what I like to get. Um, but yeah, let's see how this looks on. And it does have a wide fit to it. I do like these fits, this type of fitting. It's just, if it's not my size, it looks really weird. Like, I don't want to be drowning in the tops. The back has a button closure to it. And then also this um, really cute ruffle detail at the ends. Let's go ahead and see how that looks. And then I also grabbed a pair of petite jeans. Um, the Loft has a really good denim selection for petite sizes, and I thought I'd pick one up just so I can show you guys what they look like and I can check out the quality. But these jeans, let's see, I was able to get um, in size 26 petite, and this one I got on sale for $39.75. And it's got a... It's a high waist with the destructed bottoms, which are really on trend right now. And so I figured I can try this out with the tops that I got, just so we can pair them together and see what they look like. So let's go ahead and try these on. Right, guys, so this is the first dress right here. Um, just for reference, I'm 5'1". Um, and this is what it looks like on me. I just paired it with a pair of um, sneakers. And yeah. I feel like the fit is perfect. Whoa! <laughs> I feel good in it. Um, it's very freeing. It's very cool. Um, it is summertime here officially in Washington, so um, this dress I can see every day. It's very casual um, and just really comfortable. Alright guys, so this is the jumpsuit that I was able to purchase. I really like this. Out of all the jumpsuits that I purchased, and I like jumpsuits, um, this one has pockets. It's very form-fitting and I feel like it does good things for me. Um, the length is perfect, so I just paired it with some sandals. Um, the print is pretty and it has this like little ruffle detail. It is a zip back but it is so comfortable. You can definitely wear this during the summer. It's, it's, it's flowy, you don't feel like you're constricted in it. Um, but yeah, this is what it looks like. Just super cute. You can wear a nice summer hat at the top with this and it would just look so girly and classy. Um, but I love this. This is probably um, my favorite so far. So, yeah. So these are the petite jeans that I purchased. It is a size 26 petite, and it is high waist with the raw hem. And then this is the top that I purchased as well in petite size. This is what the print looks like. It's got a flutter sleeve, but it's not quite exaggerated, so um, it doesn't make your shoulders broader than you normally would, but um, these jeans, they are stretchy, so you could, if you want it to be more fitted, you can definitely pull it off. Um, I can probably go up to the next size, but again, these jeans, I believe, are stretchy. So once you wear them in, they'll definitely stretch out a little bit. So I would probably stick to your normal size. I would say it's true size, definitely. Same jeans, different top. So this is that peplum white sleeveless top. I think it's really pretty. You have to wear an accessory with it because it does look a little weird and empty up at the top here. So I just put on a necklace and then I just changed my shoes with something a little bit more girly. Um, I think it's really pretty. It's very comfortable. This fits very nice. 
and it does give you a little shape because of the peplum bottom and it is a little see-through so you definitely have to wear a, a nude bra with this the back is still really cute like, You can, you can even, you know, play around with it for a tuck. But I like to show off the peplum shape to it. Yeah. This is the other peachy pink top that I got. I was a little worried about the sleeves because usually when I get flutter sleeves like this, it just accentuates my shoulders and they're already big, big to begin with. But because it is a different material, this silky type of material, it falls and it doesn't just stay up and it, it doesn't make my shoulders look that much bigger. And it's just a really good quality top. It is a thin sweater like top that you can still wear. You can still front tuck it if you like, if you like to wear your tops like that. Um, same jeans and you can still have space to accessorize. But overall, I think it's really pretty. So you can kind of see the little detail there. It's just really pretty summery top. You can wear any pretty flats, shoes, and um, just look really cute. this is the last dress that I purchased um, it's definitely a little longer than I would like but I guess that's how the style of the dress is supposed to be the flutter sleeves here they tend to fall forward like this a lot I'm not sure if I like that how that falls but um, it's a cute dress I don't know that it's my style per se but it is very comfortable it's a stretchy cotton fabric that's very cool feeling feeling um, but this is what this looks like able to get everything um, on sale and with all the pieces that I purchased for this haul came to around the $230 range. So um, when you make purchases off the loft, just make sure that you wait for a sale. Like everything always goes on sale online and they tend to have a sale, a 40% off sale, like ongoing throughout the year. So um, just so you can save some money, just make sure you wait for those sales because it will happen. Like there's, just so many sales there all the time you just have to constantly look and even then like think of any holiday you can think of and there will they will have a sale for all them. right that is everything that I purchased I hope you guys enjoyed it leave some comments down below let me know which one's your favorite or any other pieces you'd like me to search for um, as far as like petite sizes or anything from my loft hauls um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this channel if you did like it please give me a thumbs up that way I know exactly what kind of video you guys like to see and also if you like watching my videos please subscribe thank you again for joining me today I will see you guys real soon thanks bye bye